I mean, have you guys ever wondered how to get out of a nine to five job? You have to understand that the best way you can do it is make sure you're living on $10 a day and get yourself money from the government and then just save a bit of money or do something like that in terms of that sense and ask for money from your parents and then make 2000 bucks and have $2,000 and that's 200 days of freedom. You get what I mean? Because you have to understand that freedom with free accommodation, I mean, when you have free accommodation to live and you have free Wi-Fi and your parents are giving you free Wi-Fi and also free accommodation or whatever, you have to understand that you need to calculate how much you need every single day in finances. So what you do every day is go and see to have a financial calendar and a financial input to understand how much money you can live on. I can live on $10 a day. I can live on $10 a day because my biological dad also gives me free accommodation and also free Wi-Fi right now. And you have to understand that I take full responsibility for that in a way that I'm investing more into everything because you have to understand that my business is really life coaching. And you have to understand that even though he gives me free accommodation and free Wi-Fi, I still have to do these videos and I still have to coach myself and I still have to give you the life skills on how I succeed. I realize that you may be saying that I'm lucky and whatever, although guess what? You're lucky too because you had your parents and I never did have your parents. I never did have your sister and brother in my life. I didn't have what you had in life. Although guess what? You're lucky. You get it? So guess what? I'm saying here that we I realize what you need to do in life is go without the nine to five job and live on a certain amount of dollars and create more freedom with those dollars. And the way you do it is say you have 400 bucks. You have 400 bucks? I realize that's 40 days of freedom. I mean, all you really need is just $10 a day with food. I realize I don't know how much you eat, although everybody's different. I can eat up to 15 bucks a day, although I can also eat up to $7.50 a day. You have to understand that $10 is where I price myself in terms of life in a way that I'm free. Although I never price myself with 10 bucks, I'm more than $10. You have to understand I'm really enjoying my life never working for money. I never work for money because you never work for money. And you should understand that you never price yourself with a price tag, such as $10 or anything. I'm not $10, I'm not anything that you say I am. I'm not this world. I'm something greater than this world. You have to understand, so what you do in life is go and leverage and ask your mother for 600 bucks and go and have two months of freedom with that money. And go to the government and get the money and then realize to save a bit of it, and then guess what? You're going to have some time freedom. You understand? Because that money is printed anyway, and you don't work for printed money. You have to understand that those people who are forcing you to go work the 9 to 5 job right now, you have to understand that they do not have your best interest in mind. Because they're saying you must go work because everybody else is. And guess what? I realize if you have no business to fight them off, you will also fall into the trap of the 9 to 5. I realize I never have to fall into the trap of the 9 to 5 because I have my life coaching degree inside my YouTube account and Mega Drive. I have over 400 hours of videos and guess what? I'm just 28 in one. I realize my age is 28. I realize I've got, I've got the next 72 years to make 50,000 videos and more so that I can coach you. I mean, that's my business. And the 9 to 5 job, I realize that job right there is me working for somebody else. And that's nowhere in terms of where I can make a video in a restaurant to do my life coaching, I realized that they would fire me for that. You get it? Because I'd be working for them. I never worked for them in the first place. You get it? So what I do is I gain everything I can. I use the money that I have to leverage freedom. So I have 1,200 bucks now. I realize I have 120 I realize I have 120 days worth of freedom. I realize that if the government man makes me work or anything like that I realize that the whole point is i'm using everybody's money so that i can succeed much more because the whole point here is to understand that you can always leverage more time you can always leverage more freedom you use their money you use opm or as opm is called other people's money you have to understand that no matter what you're doing i realize if you need to become a multi-billionaire you have to use other people's money and you don't work for it you get it you don't work to own 500 million houses. You just go to the bank, you grab all the money, and then you go and get it. 
and how do you get the i mean how do you get 500 million real estates you invest in knowledge to do so you go and get the knowledge that's going to help you to do that i realize i'm able to be away from the nine to five job because i've got something better to do than work as a waiter i've got life skills to teach you i've got nice beautiful time management skills where i can teach you so if you have parents i mean leverage them i mean leverage their car i mean take their car as much as you can and not take the car although just invest in the car as much as you can so that you don't have to walk one hour or 20 minutes or 15 minutes to the shops i mean just say you're going to grab the car for five minutes to grab something to eat and then you're coming back and you're not coming back you're just coming here again and you're always going to be here you understand because you're just grabbing the car to go to the shops to get something to eat and then you're moving forward and that's that you have to understand that you have to go and leverage your life as much as you can you have to leverage everything you have in life because that's the only way you're going to succeed you have to understand that i was supposed to do street performance although guess what i am not going to do street performance because i've got something better to do i've got to hit myself in a better way and what is that i realize i'm going to really spice up my lifestyle i am doing all these videos now online so that i can succeed and what am i really doing to succeed i'm posting one minute videos here and there and as much as i can online so that everybody can watch and then guess what i realize people are going to eventually say that this guy's somebody you have to understand that i am teaching you something along the way on how you can become financially free and it's not the money that's going to make you financially free i realize that i'm away from the nine to five job for a reason because i understand that 20 dollars an hour is not going to cut it i'm worth more than 20 bucks an hour so what do i do i go build up the skills and i go and read as much as i can so that i can have a threshold that says i never need a nine to five anymore i realize that once i have this threshold i'm never going back i realize if you reach level 10 threshold it means you never need a nine to five anymore i'm at that threshold although i'm at a greater threshold i'm level 500 and more in threshold which means i never have to work a nine to five job anymore and you have to understand that now i help other people escape that i realize that i'm an escape go in a way that i'm doing better than yesterday and the whole point of life is to work on your eye and work on yourself every day because it's not about working a nine to five job because the nine to five job is never going to get you anywhere you have to understand that they print one thousand dollars in one second and they make you work for it and you have to understand that it's not the way to go I promise you that when you're working for other people, you're not working for yourself. I'm working for myself here so that I can work for something greater because something greater says I must help everybody. So the way I do that is I do more work than they do at the 9 to 5 job. And what kind of work is that? I realize it's work on I. I work on I. I work on I. I work on I. I, 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 I have a dream. I have a dream to understand that I love you. You have to understand, I use everybody's money, and then here I am. I live with 10 bucks a day. And guess what? Because I live with 10 bucks a day, I have 10 months worth of freedom. I have 10 months worth of freedom now. I can work on my life coaching videos. I can post 20 videos a day and more, which are all one minute each, and hashtag it and all of this kind of stuff, although I never hashtag anymore because I have no need to hashtag. I'll go and do my content instead. Because in hashtags, I don't learn anything. And guess what? You don't have to hashtag. You just post one minute videos. And then I just go post 50 videos a day on YouTube. For the next 10 months. I mean 50 minutes worth of videos and 50 gateways online where people can find me on YouTube. And then suddenly, over time, I realize people are going to start coming into my playlist. Because I'll have 5,000 videos there sitting and it's all educational. And I said, they're going to start educating themselves because I'm somebody worth it. I'm somebody who's worth it. I'm teaching self-education. So I've got, I've got myself into self-education because I have mentors. I read with mentors every single day. And now I have over 400 hours of videos already. I mean, how many do you have? I mean, if you started with nothing, I started with nothing too. I dedicated myself into these videos. So you have to understand. That for the next 10 months, because I have freedom, I actually have freedom for the next 10 months, I'll be throwing one minute videos up online and I don't care who's following me because guess what? I'm giving you information to help you. So if you unlike me and you unsubscribe because I'm posting all these videos, I don't care because I do care 
Although I just don't care about you, I care about my success to give you success more. You get it? I mean, you can always turn off the notifications and you can always come into my playlist and watch what I've got to say. I promise you all though, that the new way to find freedom is use the government's money and then live on $10 a day with your parents. And now, if you're not in that case, you have to understand that what you do is something better. You make sure that you go and invest in education and in yourself and in your mindset and mentality and go and find the freedom that you can live with. I realize that my freedom is I use the government's money. I use everybody's money. I use my parents' money. I use my dad's free accommodation center. I mean, what are you going to say about that? I use my dad. I use his car. I use his food. I use everything he has. I realize I can drink tap water. I go to the fridge. I get my biological dad's water because I'll never invest in that water. Although I invest, I never invest in actual bottled water, although he does. And then I just go into the fridge and I grab it. Yeah, because I'm leveraging him. I'm leveraging him as much as I can because that's what you have to do. I have a biological mother who's overseas and I say, you must send me 600 bucks because that's two months of freedom for me. I mean, two months of freedom. You have to understand that what I can do with two months of freedom in terms of my business, I don't need anybody else. I, I live here alone. I live here in my room alone, although my biological dad is just over there. I mean, he's in the living room smoking cigarettes and that's why I never go there. Although he comes and sees me. And then guess what? I say, you got 50 bucks? Or else when he has 50 bucks, or else you give me 50 bucks? And guess what? I have five days of I have five days worth of freedom. I realize that accommodation is already done. I realize that the Wi-Fi, I have I have free Wi-Fi. I have free Wi-Fi already. I upload all my videos inside my accommodation center because I have free Wi-Fi here. I do all my videos over here. I've got nobody else around me to distract me from my videos. You understand? So I go and leverage everybody's money and I'm not stealing money. I'm not stealing money because that money is printed. You understand? I mean, what they are still—I mean, they are really stealing your time if you are going to work the nine to five. So don't allow them to do that. I mean, if they're pushing you to work the nine to five, I realize that it's either because you are not confident in yourself to have your own business, and that's why they're doing it. Otherwise, they'll never push you. You never have to be on the government allowance. I realize that if they cut me off now with the money I borrow from them. I'm borrowing the money to live. I mean, I use other people's money. I mean, why do I have to work the nine to five when I can grab the money now and live for free and never have to work a nine to five? I mean, why would you work for the money when you can grab their money now and never work for it? I mean, I'm using their money. So I realize they give me some allowance or something. I realize I grab it, I live for free. I realize they, I realize they try to make me work, although guess what? I realize I move areas. I'll go somewhere else. I realize now, I realize I've got another month to job search. I've got another month to job search, and guess what? I realize that when somebody says something in terms of how I have to live life, I'll go and change area again. Because how are they going to catch up to me? I mean, you have to understand that whatever is happening right now is that they will try to make you work the nine to five. You can go and change areas. I mean, go and change your state and go into another state. I promise you, you've got two months extra to live for free. I mean, they'll be giving you money and you've got two months extra to live. And then you go and change area. You go, you go somewhere else. And then you go another two months for free to live because you're job searching in another area now. And then you change areas after two weeks. I, promise you, I mean, how are you supposed to work a nine to five if you're always on the move? I mean, they always give you money. I mean, that's what I did for one, I mean, I did that for one year and four months. I grabbed the money and I just traveled. I traveled Australia for free. I went to Adelaide, I went to Brisbane, I went to Melbourne, I went to Sydney, I went to Perth, I went to Brisbane, in Gold Coast and Sunshine Coast, I went to Mooloolaba and Townsville and Cairns. I went to Sunshine Coast in terms of the Noosa. I went to also Mooloolaba and the other one, which is Marichador. I went to Hobart, I went to Adelaide. I went to Alice Springs. I've seen the Ayers Rock. I mean, I used the government's money. I, I went for free. I mean, other people have to work for that money and go. You get it? I, ne I never work for the money. You get it? I realize that now. I realize that many people will be jealous of this and how I did it. 
Although, guess what? I did it. And guess what? The whole point is that you understand I'm teaching you something. I'm teaching you that you can go and do the same thing. You just go change areas. You go change some other area in life. And just keep changing your areas in life. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I've got nothing to lie about. But as although that, you have to understand that whatever's happening, you just make sure that you go and live much fully. Realize that each and every single time now I get some money, realize that I can live on ten dollars a day. I mean, how much can you live on? Realize that when I get four hundred dollars from the government, I borrow the money. I realize I'm just borrowing the money. I borrow the money and then I give you guys educational skills and the government's skills. I give them skills on how you guys can all escape that nine to five job. You understand? I realize that I have no need for a nine to five job. I have no need for that anymore. Because I've already escaped it. I've already got I've already got so much time now and I've got ten months of freedom. I'm an escape goat in a better way. I realize the whole point now is that you understand that you go and create your freedom. Because since I have ten months of freedom, because I have a certain amount of dollars, I realize I can live on that money. I don't even have to get chased by them anymore. I realize that if they cut my allowance off, I realize I've got ten months of freedom. I've got 10 months of freedom. And what's going to happen in that 10 months? Because that 10 months is going to grow me a lot. I mean, for 10 months, you'll understand how many videos I can post on YouTube, how much content I can make. I mean, I can make my music now. I've got freedom. I'm, I'm going to be single. I'm single for the next 10 months. I mean, I'm single, and I don't need a woman around me either. I don't need to chase them. I don't, I, don't, I don't need to chase the woman. I don't go around the crowd anymore. I don't go around other people anymore. Because I understand that life is more serious now. I understand life is more serious, so there's no time to be with other people. Or else I have to be with I. I have to be with I. I don't even go around my biological dad, even though I live with him. I came to Sydney because I understand that when they press you, or else that they start giving you less of an allowance. And then guess what? I came here because I created 10 months of freedom now. I created 10 months of freedom. Or else that when I was going around Australia, I was giving rent. I was giving 25 bucks rent every single day. With their money. You understand? I mean, I was living one day at a time. And I'm still living one day at a time. You understand? I realize that you have to watch your words as well. You have to understand that it's really how lucky I am. Although we're all lucky. I realize we're all lucky to have Jesus Christ in our life. I realize you are lucky to have your life. And where you live. And who you grew up around. You have to understand that we are lucky to live life. You understand? So, be that un I realize that you have to be that individual who understands that Money alone is not going to make you happy. I promise you now, I may be borrowing all this money, although guess what? I realized that when I went traveling around Australia, I realized it's a new scenery that made me happier because I expanded. I have the Ayers Rock, which is so big, I realized it's in my heart because I can see it in my heart. I've been in it. I've been there. I've seen it live. I realized I can see all the scenery that I've seen around Australia for one year and four months. I realized it's been an incredible journey. And now, here I am with 10 months freedom now. I mean, before I didn't have that kind of freedom. Although I was living it one day at a time. And calculating my finances and making sure that I can live on what they were... I realized I was making sure that I can live on what they were giving me. I realized that no matter what, you have to understand that whatever they were giving me, you have to understand is only that you understand that I'm doing much better. I'm just doing much better because 600 bucks a fortnight in terms of what they were giving me is what I had to go around. I have more than that now because guess what? I realize it's not the money that makes you happy. I realize I was doing videos all along the way when I was traveling before. I have over 400 hours of videos now. You also have to start. You have to start your videos. You have to understand that Grand Canon, for example, I realize Grand Canon, for example, has 5,000 videos now. I realize that I watched his video before when he had 750 and he's saying how he has 750 videos online. And now he's got 5,000. I realize now the numbers are adding up and he's better than yesterday too. So I'm heading into that direction now. I realize that no matter what, I may get some hate. Although, guess what? I just gave you information on how you can do so. I realize you live with your parents and you don't be ashamed about it. You grab the car. You grab whatever they have. You leverage the freedom. I realize my biological dad doesn't talk to me much. I realize he doesn't give me too much consideration in terms of words. Although, he gave me freedom in terms of the accommodation center. And now, the government is giving him money, and also this house that you see around me, you have to understand that it's 
House Commission. One of those, now, I live inside. One of those, I'm not living outside. You have to understand that this, in terms of this room outside of me, in terms of outside of I, you have to understand that it's I over me. You have to understand that it's really that it's housing commission. And the government gave me this. Or does the government gave it to my dad and to me? Or does the government gave it to I and my dad? And now you have to understand that it's luck. Although, guess what? I realize we're all lucky. You have to understand that we're all lucky. And now, I before in my life, I was a drug addict. I was a cigarette smoker. I was an alcohol and I was very, I was on alcohol and I was an alcoholic and I was also very fat and I was eating meat. And guess what? I overcame it all. I was schizophrenic too. I went to rehab three times. I almost committed suicide three times. I mean, how, Danny? I mean, how? I mean, how is 99% of Australia poor in finances? I mean, how? I mean, how is there only 36 million millionaires in life? How? I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, is it luck? I mean, is it luck that you're living today? I promise you, it's luck. You're lucky. You're the chosen one today. You're the chosen one today that you are living life today. I realize that you don't complain when you see other people succeeding. I realize that I have to, I have to make sure that I never go around other people. I grew up with 5,000 people in my community. In terms of Serbian people, I realize they all hate me. I never go around them. I have only I as my friend. I am my true friend in life. I have no other friends. I don't have to go there. I don't have to go chase women anymore. I don't have to go escorts. I don't have to go brothels. I went, I went, I've been there. I've been there. I've done all that. I don't have to call them anymore. I don't have to call those women. I don't have to talk to anybody online anymore. Because that's what it takes to succeed. You don't talk to them anymore. You go your way. I update myself every single day with mentors. I have mentors. I have a music production now. Because now, I'm really succeeding forward. And now, how am I able to give you this courage to be able to say that I just borrowed money off the government that's printed in terms of the money? Realize that it's honest. And now, no matter what, you have to understand that when I live my life fully, I borrow money from other people to live. I don't go working for the money. I'm not stupid. I was working for the money before. I was a forklift driver. I was a laborer. I was picking up heavy metal. I was picking up heavy pallets. I was washing cows. I was driving a van to the city in traffic. I was, that's not the lifestyle. I mean, who was I helping there? I mean, nobody. I was helping nobody except I. I realize now, who am I helping now? I'm helping myself and you. I'm helping I and you. I mean, how am I helping you? I'm helping you for development and information products. And I'm giving information and I'm putting my face out there too. And I'm in the spotlight. I don't know you. I've never seen you. I realize you've seen me though. I realize that's the difference between success. You've seen me. I've never seen you. I realize who's more successful. You understand? I've never seen you though. You have to get me now. You have to start doing these videos. You have to start doing a lot of videos. You have to start coaching people. You have to start realizing that life is on your side when you create more freedom. I look for any opportunity to create more freedom. I, I realize just now that if I have to work the nine to five, I'll make a thousand bucks. I'll say, I'll quit my job. I have 100 free days to live. I have 100 days to live for free. I also will say that no matter what, that in the nine to five job, I promise you that will never make me work more than 15 hours a week. Because that's the rule. You have to work 15 minimal hours. I realize that in the government rules of Australia, you have to work 15 minimal hours a week. I mean, bare minimum. You have to understand that they will not make me work more than that. I'll say no every time. You get me? Or does now? Or does that, since you understand that is another way to create time. Or does you don't have to work 25 hours a week. You don't have to work 30 hours a week. You work 50 minimum hours if you have to work your 9 to 5 job. And then go and use your other 140 hours to create a business on the or less, to create a business on the side. You have plenty of time. You have to understand that if they're making you work on 9 to 5, I mean go and work 15 hours a week only. Or less, if you got a debt with a car and if you got a mortgage, or less, that you get rid of it as much as possible. You get rid of the car, you get rid of the mortgage. You lose the house, you don't need it. You're moving back, you're moving back with your parents. You forget the car, you're gonna start 
going with the bus and train now. You understand? Because that car is going to kill you. I promise you now, the government doesn't give you money for petrol. I promise you, the government doesn't give you money so that you can go and support your car and service your car. I promise you, that's what the 9 to 5 work is for. I mean, they make you work in a 9 to 5 so that you can go and service your car, which is $600 every week. I mean, just to fix your car and everything. I mean, you're working the whole week for that. I mean, you don't work for the car, you don't work for petrol, you don't work for money, you don't work for other people. You work for Jesus Christ. You have to understand that Jesus Christ gave wisdom into this world. And the Bible is full of it. And full of information that's going to help you. Because Jesus never hurt you, I never hurt you either. You have to understand that what's important here is the wisdom that you're giving. You give more wisdom every single day, you'll understand that every single day you're going to be your own maker. You're going to create something. You're going to be something more. You have to speak from the heart. You have to live your life much greater. You have to do something much greater than you've ever done before. So the best way you can live life is to make sure that you go and help people via camera. Because today is a new age. Because today is the knowledge resource. And you've got the internet. And go and take advantage of social media and everything. I use Mega Drive and many people do not understand what Mega Drive does. I promise you, Mega Drive, which is my online storage, helps me upload images and videos and audio and PDF and everything. I promise you now, no other social media will help you do that. I promise you, Instagram doesn't help you upload videos in terms of high quality and I realize that no matter what, that Instagram will help you upload images and also I realize that Instagram will help you upload images and videos and audio. Although you have to understand that it's really that they don't help you upload so much and guess what it's really that mark zuckerberg will block you as soon as you start spamming and you start posting so much i realize that via mega drive i can go and upload thousands of quotes at one and i can give it to you for free right now i realize i can make 100 quotes a day and upload it right now and you can be able to see it in one second i don't have to go through amazon to give you quotes i don't have to go through instagram to give you quotes i don't have to go through other social medias to give you quotes i realize that youtube is only videos and audios. I realize it's, it's, I realize it's main, I realize that YouTube is mainly videos. I realize Mega Drive is everything. I realize Mega Drive is writing, audio, and everything. Although you understand that Mega Drive is something that is going to help you to go and upload all your content. So when you have hundreds of gigabytes in your phone, I realize you go put an online storage over an external USB. I realize if you lose, if, I realize if you lose an external, I realize if you lose the external USB of all your contents and all your courses and all your images that you've ever had in your life, and you lose that one little USB, you're finished. Or else that's why Mega Drive is so important. Or else now Facebook and all that is going to help you and or else social media will help you to a certain extent, although they're going to block you very soon. Or else now, I don't use Snapchat. I don't use Instagram. I don't use TikTok. I mean, why? I don't, I don't, I don't use LinkedIn. I mean, why? Because they limit you. I mean, they limit you to what you can do. I promise you that those social media platforms are very limiting. I, I use Instagram, and this is what I use Instagram for. I post 100 photos into my Instagram story every day. I, was, I sit and I upload 60 photos into my Instagram feed of I. I was, that's it. And then I post one video into my Instagram feed in terms of my Instagram reel, and one video into my IGTV when I have a new song that I made. And that's that. Well, that's the whole function there. And then I go into YouTube and I post as many one minute videos as I can every single day. Well, actually, that's that. And I teach along the way as much as I can. So I have now 10 months of freedom to be able to teach you. So with that 10 months of freedom, I can go and create more freedom. I realize that how am I really going to do that? I realize I'm going to give you as much information as possible. I'm going to give you a service like never before. I'm going to give you information like nobody else can. I'm going to give you something of skills and nature, and then what are you going to do with it? You're going to go and promote it. You're going to go and really take action, and then I'll inspire you because of it. You get it? And that's that. And then what are you going to do? You're going to go and promote me. Because I helped you. I gave you ideas. I gave the ideas, so why wouldn't you help me? You get it? So that's how business collaboration does in life. I give you information, you do it, you pass it on, you credit me. You get it? I realize that's that. I realize it's I over me. I realize that I is everything. 
So when I go and live my life now, you have to understand, I go and look for ways to create more freedom. I was in Adelaide recently, and I said, I have to find freedom because the government was pinning me down. And I was making a certain amount of money, and then they dropped it completely. And then I realized that I had to change my circumstances because from that point, I could no longer travel around Australia because of how much they dropped the money, because of my age and because of everything. Although, guess what? I said, I have a nice beautiful accommodation center over here with my biological dad, and it's freedom. And I don't have to work on 9 to 5. I mean, for at least two months, I don't have to work on 9 to 5 because I create that time freedom here. And then what do I do? I say, I'll be traveling to Melbourne in a month. I mean, what's the point in looking for a 9 to 5 job? I mean, they'll say, I mean, they'll say, you really sure? I'm like, yeah. Oh, I have to go to, I have to go to Melbourne. I mean, they're gonna, I mean, they may ask me, what will I do in Melbourne? I'll, I'll just go there because I have to see it. I've seen it already. I have to see it again. Or else they're going to let you off and they're going to still give you some money. You get it? And then I've got one month freedom there and then I've got 30 days to work on my business. Or else that's the main idea. I've got 30 days to work on my business now. You understand? Or else now. I mean, the option is that you don't have to be with the government allowance. Or else I don't have to be there because what I do now is I'll grab their money as much as I can and if they cut it off completely, I've got 10 months of freedom. I've got 10 months of freedom already because that's the kind of insurance I have. I mean, most people have to work a 9 to 5 because they don't know where their money is going. I don't even know where my money is going, although I see it. I know nothing in life except I. I, have to, I need you to understand that I have a nice, beautiful financial calendar and I write in it every single day about where my finances are going. And that's why I can live on 10 months freedom. I can live with 10 bucks a day. You get it? Or else 10 bucks means a lot when you can live one day every single day on 10 bucks. Or else that's amazing. You know what I'm saying? So to create 10 months of freedom is amazing. So now I just grab as much money as I can and then guess what I do? I'll go and promote myself much better. You have to understand that no matter what happens, that if anybody puts me in jail because of printed money, or else that no matter what, or else I'll never, even, I'll never have to go to jail for anything, because guess what? I'm already something of a civilian. I'm already something destined for life. Unless I've given you knowledge about how I do it. You have to understand that no matter what, I promise you, it's really that if you pin me down, you're also pinning yourself down. I promise you, it's really how I really see it. I understand I've got nothing to fear. I understand that when I live my life, I'm always here. I'm always living my life in Jesus Christ. Because the whole point of this life is understand that I don't need the government to succeed. I don't need anybody else to succeed. Realize that it's really that the governments are scamming you right now. I mean, why aren't they going to prison? I mean, they're the ones that are creating the laws. You understand? I mean, they're working. You, I mean, they're making you work like a slave. I mean, they're making you work like a slave for what? I mean, to make their business. I mean, to make them money. You deserve better than that. You deserve better than working for printed money. You deserve to work for Jesus. You deserve to have everything without money. You understand? Because money doesn't bring happiness. You have to understand that growth does. I teach you growth skills. I teach you how to really live your life. I've got nothing to be afraid of. I've got nothing to be afraid of because I understand that when I live my life, I'm living free, always. I live free, always. I'm always going to be somebody who's better than yesterday. I'm always somebody who's going to do more. You have to understand that each and every single day, you put your heart into it, you make sure that you go and live your life much better. Prosh, that's the key. Prosh, the key is make sure that what you're doing, you give people information on how to do so, and you let it be. You let yourself understand that you can use other people's money to succeed. I mean, if you're not using other people's money, you're losing. I use the government's money. I mean, I've been using the government's money since I was five years young. I've been using the government's money since I was a baby. And I'm a baby now. I'm still a baby, although since one year is young. I mean, now I'm 28 and one. I have 28 years of age, although when I was one year of young, I realized when I was young, in terms of I'm young now, although when I was one years, I realized when I was one years of age, I was using the government's money. I was using their money to live for free. I mean, that was, I mean they were giving me money a fortnight. I realized they were giving me money a fortnight. I realized I, I was aging 
I went to two years of age, and then three years of age, and four years of age, and they'll give me money. I mean, why didn't she put me in jail back then? I mean, what are you going to say? I mean, I mean, why? I mean, why? I mean, I, I see what you mean. You're giving money so that you can put people into nine to five jobs. I understand. Although, guess what? I realize that is the whole point of not working nine to five. I'm sure the whole point I'm not. I realize the whole point I'm not working nine to five is make sure that you never work in the first place. I mean, you never work in nine to five job. You're making sure that you're doing something amazing, and you're making sure that no matter what, you're going to help people. I realize now. I'm leveraging my I'm, I'm leveraging my biological dad. I'm leveraging the internet. I'm leveraging free internet. I'm leveraging everything I can so that I can succeed more. You understand? Because it's not the money that makes me successful. I made 400 hours of videos that will make you successful, though. You get it? Question the money. I can give you one million dollars, and what are you going to do with it? I mean, what I mean, what are you going to do with billion? I mean, what are you going to do with? I mean, what are you going to do with ten billions of dollars? I mean, what are you going to do with 10 billion? I realize, what are you, I realize, what are you going to do with 10 billion dollars right now? And tens and billions of dollars. I mean, the best you can do is probably go around traveling. And what? I mean, who are you going to bring along? You're going to bring a girlfriend? I mean, I mean, how are you going to get her? I mean, how are you going to get a husband from that point? I mean, you're going to say you have all this money. And they're going to go for you because of the money. And now you're going to take her along with you and she's going to love you because of the money and not because of you and he's going to love you because of the money and then you're going to have a kid with him or her and now you're much more of a family although I realize that she loves you because of the money and not because of you you get it? I realize now you have kids and what are you going to do now? I mean now you're traveling you're traveling with her I mean I mean, how boring I mean, I mean where are you going? I mean it's just you guys I mean nobody else knows you I mean, nobody else sees you. I mean, you guys are behind the scenes. I mean, you guys are like little people in the planet. I mean, you're like middle class. I mean, I mean, nobody knows the middle class people. I mean, you have ten, you have tens of billions of dollars. I mean, you're not in the spotlight. You're not teaching anybody anything. You get? It? I mean, you may have your own jets. I mean, who cares? I mean, who are you helping with the money? I mean, who are you helping? I mean, how are you donating that money? I mean, wh I mean, where are your skills? In life I mean are you public speaking you're probably not public speaking with that money and you're probably not giving man I realize you're probably not giving money in terms of value in terms of information although you have to understand that it's really you must give informational money and everything in terms of material much more although you have to understand that when you have tens and billions of dollars realize that when you go traveling around with your wife and kids and family I mean what's the good about that I mean, who are you helping except you and your family? I mean, that's what middle class people are doing. You get it? I mean, they're just helping themselves. I mean, you, have, you may have all this money. I mean, you're not a celebrity. I mean, you're not famous. I mean, you're not something inspirational in life. You're not inspirational. You're not helping people. You get it? You have all this money in the world. I mean, you may own, you may have, you may own half the world's real estate. I mean, nobody knows you. In life, I mean, nobody knows you. I mean, you didn't create YouTube videos. You didn't help people with information. I mean, what a life! I mean, is that all you're going to do? You know, drive your jets, you know, drive your family to places, you know, just see the areas. And I realize, and what? I realize, and what now? I realize that's not the way to go. I realize you're just going to travel the world and not communicate with other people. You get it? I mean, you may communicate with your family, although your friends of the past are gone. I mean, everybody's gone. And you're your only friend in life. You have to understand now that you have a family, you have a kid, you're traveling the world, and you're in your jet, you have real estate, you have money, you have the family. I mean, what else? I mean, you, you, I mean, you may have a body. You may have the muscles. I mean, you may have a social media profile, although you don't really inspire people on it. You don't inspire other people. I mean, you're finished. You're finished already. Because you have to understand that it's not the money that's gonna make you happier. I mean I mean money doesn't get you freedom. Probably money doesn't get you freedom because guess what? I use other people's money to get freedom. You understand? I use other people's money to get freedom. I don't work for it. 
Or else, how does that work? Or else, it works easily because guess what? I made the time. Or else, money didn't make my freedom. I made the freedom. Or else, money didn't do it for me. I did it for I in something greater. You get it? Or else, that money doesn't make more time. Or else, you make more time. You make more freedom. You understand the freedom is important in life. Or else, that you go and leverage. Everything that you can. And now, you have to understand that social security is never to be relied upon anyway. I never rely on the government anyway anymore. I don't rely on them. I just borrow their money. I'm just borrowing the money. I give it back. I already gave it back already. I gave it back in 400 hours of videos. I gave it back. I don't know how much. I mean, how much did you leave? I mean, how much did you give me? You gave me $50,000 around my lifetime from the age of 1 to the age of 28. You may have given me how much? I mean, one hundred thousand dollars. I'll give it back to you. I'll give it back to you. I'll give you everything back. I mean, now you didn't help me at all. You good? You have to understand that it's really that money doesn't help you at all. Well, that money doesn't grow you. I promise you, money doesn't grow on trees either. I promise you that what grows on trees and what helps you is wisdom, and it's more information that you need. You need more information about it. Or else I can go to 9 to 5 work now. I can go work the 9 to 5 then. I'll go make 5,000 bucks. I'll live 500 days for free. I'll live 500 days for free in my biological dads. You understand me? I'll make 1,000 bucks and then I'll work for free for 100 days. You understand? I mean, I'll go make 1,000 bucks. I have 1,000 credits anyway with the government, which means I'll make 1,000 bucks. And they'll still give me some money on the side. So I'll have 1,800 bucks. Or else I have 180 days worth of freedom by just making 1,000 bucks at the 9 to 5 job. I have, a, I have six months of freedom from that. I work two weeks at the 9 to 5 job. I mean, full time. I work 60 hours. I work 60 hours and make 1,000. And they'll give me another 800. Or else now I say I quit the job. I have 100. I have six months of freedom. I don't have to work a 9 to 5 job for 6 months now. I'm going to do my business now. I mean, what are you going to do? You understand? I can live with 10 bucks a day. How about you? I realize if you don't know, I realize it's because you don't have a financial calculator. You don't have a journal. I realize if life is difficult, you don't have a journal. I have a journal every single day. I write in it. You can go check it out. I have a journal. I have a free helpline as well. You, you can always message me. Although, guess what? I realize many people don't. Because nobody else has. I posted it one month ago. I posted a free helpline. I promise you they're not, help I promise you they're not asking me for help. You get it? I realize it's because of my fame. I realize it's because of my success. I realize it's because of my Instagram and because of my 400 hours of video content. And it's because of my 9,000 photos of I on Instagram. I realize that's why they don't message me. I realize it's because of my 900 followers. I realize it's because of my skin. I realize it's because of my hair. You understand? I mean, oh well. I mean, go find your Muhammad Gandhi over there. I love Muhammad Gandhi. I realize that it's some Indians who dislike me. I realize it's some Pakistani people. I love Muhammad Gandhi though. I don't mean to diss Muhammad. I never even diss Muhammad Gandhi. I love Muhammad Gandhi. You understand? I mean, when you point people to Muhammad Gandhi, I promise you it's the best way. You understand? I realize that I realize a lot of Middle Eastern people don't like me. I don't know why. I realize that it's probably because of my beard. I realize it's because of my Serbian nature and Croatian nature. I don't know. Although I understand that when I go and live my life much better, unless I just go and do much better. In a sense, so realize that I am always loving this world in a way that I'm growing. You have to understand that money will not give you freedom. I promise you now that what gives you freedom is the time management skills and it's also your reading skills and your reading ability and your information and your drive to succeed probably it's your ability to speak from the heart and to communicate with other people probably it's your leadership to be able to give more than you receive i can give you a thousand bucks today and what are you going to do with it you're going to get yourself a game boy you're going to get yourself a playstation i mean that's not the way you understand i don't know what you're going to do with your money 
I realized that what I'll do with the thousand bucks today is I'll just keep it with me and I'll just go get food. I'll just get ten dollars food. I mean, that's a strict guideline. I mean, I just get food every single day. I use my car, or I use my dad's car to go get food. I come here and I start doing my work. I mean, just every day for 100 days. I mean, that's where my money goes. I mean, for 100 days. I realize my, my money, that is how much? I mean, a thousand bucks is only going into food and drink. I realize my accommodation is already here. I realize my Wi Fi is already here. I realize that's it. I, don't, I have no time for other people. I mean, that kind of strict. You get it? I mean, that's how specific I am. I was internet, I've got internet. I've got free accommodation. I was now, most people don't have that kind of opportunity. And guess what? I was you have to then go give it to rent. You have to go give it to food. And that's that. I mean, no traveling. I mean, don't not travel. You understand? And now, you have to understand that you can travel. And you can travel because I've done it for one year, four months. I've got their money. I went and traveled. I just delayed the 9 to 5 as much as I can. I kept moving. I say, what are you do? I said to them, I'm going traveling. I realized they, 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 they were asking me, what are you doing around Australia? I said, I'm just traveling. I told them already. I was they're saying, yeah, you can go. I'm like, amazing. I'm better than like, I'm better than everything. I have to understand that the government allows me to travel with their money. I already said something about it. Well, as now, what I can also do, since I live in New South Wales, I can tell them I'll, I'll go to Newcastle now. I mean, it's in New South Wales because there's a coronavirus going around, which is outside of me, and I have no coronavirus. You have to understand, that coronavirus is made up. You understand? You have to understand that I'm not negative, although you have to understand that it's all fake and it's a facade about what's going on. And they'll ask you four questions, and if you say yes to one of them, you're COVID positive. I mean, that's bullshit. You understand? I realize that is how they get 100,000 cases that is testing positive to COVID. I mean, they'll ask you five questions, and if you say yes to one question, you're COVID positive. I'm not COVID positive. You'll never be COVID positive, you have to understand. You now realize that I can go and say, I'll go to Newcastle, I'll go to Gosford, I'll go to the entrance over there. I mean, it's in New South Wales. I mean, at the moment, since it's the case, I can still get two months freedom like that. I say, I have to go live there, I'll search for jobs there, and then I'll move to Newcastle for one month. And then I'll move, I'll move to Gosford for one month because I'll, so, I'll search for jobs in Gosford. I'll search for jobs in the entrance. I'll act like I have to search for a job over there. I realize what I'm really doing is creating more time freedom along the way. Realize if I have to go to entrance now, which is 100 kilometers from here, I realize that there's no chance for me to work here in a 9 to 5 job. I realize now, I realize that they cannot force me to work in Sydney if I have to move to entrance. You get it? So I'll go to entrance, and I'll say I have to go to entrance in one month. I'll delay it. I realize now, then I say for one month? I mean, I mean in one month's time, I'll go there. And then I say, okay. I've made one month of time freedom. I made one time of fine. I made one. To, I already. I made. I made one month of time freedom. I ranted a bit just then. I realize it's just that you understand that I never rant. I give you knowledge, so you have to understand. I realize I go then. I realize that when one month comes, I realize they're gonna say, "Are you going?" I realize I had something. I had something come up. I'll go there for the next month. I realize the next month I have to go there. I was going to say okay again. I was going to say okay again. I've, got, I've just made another month of time freedom. You get it? And they're giving me money as well. And then I'll just go. Or else I'll go there then. Or else now I'll do the same thing with those. Or else there's another employment provider there. And I'll say the same thing. And I'll say, I'll have to go to Gosford in one month. You get it? I mean, there's no chance that I'd be promoting myself over there and working on a fire. When I have to move now, I have to move to Gosford, mate. I have to go to Gosford. I mean, there's no chance for me to work in the entrance. I mean, one month 
happens and then I say I have to go to Gosford on I mean I have to go into the next month because something is happening over here with whatever I have going on and I realize next month's the best decision for me to go to Gosford. Or else I just made two months because they'll say okay. You get? Or else I just made four months of time freedom. And then guess what? Or else in that time freedom I have to do some work, don't I? I have to go do my life coaching videos. I have to do my music. I have to go live free. I have to go and see the area. I have to go and experience life away from the nine to five as much as I can while I'm growing and working in my journal and working on time freedom and also updating myself with mentors every single day. You get it? Well, for the next 10 months, every single day, I'll be reading from my mentors. Or as they post 10 videos a day, I make sure to read every single one. I read it on times two. I read it on times two. I have a nice, beautiful, portable speaker over here. I have a portable speaker over here. I post on my Instagram photos that is one hour. I realize it's one hour to post everything online. And I realize it, it doesn't even have to be one hour. I realize, it's, it, I realize it can take up to an hour to post all my photos online and also do Instagram for the day. I realize I just do it once every single day. I realize I invest up to an hour to just upload all my photos online and download all my photos and put into stories and post one video and all that just to make it like that. And just to stay consistent there. I realize as I do that, I read entrepreneurship along the way. I read something as I upload photos into Instagram. And as I work online, I realize I'm always reading something every single day. I realize that as I do something, I realize as I watch Netflix, I also read entrepreneurship. And I just watch the images from Netflix, for example. You understand? So that way I multitask and I'm doing something amazing. I realize when I eat, I also read and I eat because I have no time to just eat. You get it? And sometimes I have time to just eat and listen to songs. You get it? Or else when I go on the toilet seat, I'm writing in my journal because I have no time to just sit on the toilet seat. You get it? I realize sometimes I sit on the toilet seat too and I forget the phone. Or else when I grab an idea, I have my phone there ready to write something down. Or else it's important because it's going to teach you something. So I'm always smart like that. Or else for the next 10 months, I realize my money is just going towards food and drink. I'll be here. There's no girlfriend. I mean, there's no sex. I mean, I mean, there's no kids in my life. I mean, there's no marriage proposals. You get it? I mean, for the next 10 months, I'll just be uploading 20 minutes of videos up online and more. I was up to an hour. I mean, I'll post 60 videos into YouTube every single day for the next 10 months. And what else can I do for the next 10 months? I just be with I, I journal every single day. I write about my day. And I also... I update myself with mentors every single day. I update myself with mentors every single day and I do my music production too. I also have my, I have my nice beautiful power tube over here, which means I have to do some nice beautiful architecture with my bicep. I realize I have to do biceps as well. I have to realize that I gotta start doing these ones. You get it? I have to start doing some biceps. I have to start doing some triceps. I have to start doing some muscle work around here. And I have time to just work on I over here. I mean, they're not going to chase me because I'll say I have to go to Melbourne in one month. I'll grab some money. I'll say for the next month, I'll say I have to grab some money. Or else I have to go to Melbourne. And then guess what I'll do? I'll just cut them off completely. I already have 10 months of freedom. I don't need that money. I don't need them. You guys can go work. I work already. You understand? I realize that I realize work is amazing. I realize work is amazing. So don't get me wrong and don't get me right. You have to understand that work is amazing when you're working for something greater than a nine to five job. I realize that work is shit and it's a shithole when you're working nine to five job. I realize many people are gonna say that they love to work in nine to five. I realize that's bullshit. <laughs> I realize that's bullshit. I realize that I met a lady in Adelaide Casino and she sat down playing poker and I said why do you gamble so much and she says does she love the experience of gambling I mean you love to gamble your money and you're gambling not just your money you're gambling your time too and she's like but she loves to do that you, know, you love to gamble your money and everything and she's like yes I'm like 
I say, good luck to you. You have to understand that it's really, don't gamble your time away. I used to gamble in poker. I used to go poker every single day. I used to rush to get to poker. I realized, and then I would win. Although I'd lose time. I realized four hours of playing, I realized four hours of playing poker to win 120 bucks. I could have taught you something in that video. I could have taught you something in that time. I could have uploaded 60 minutes worth of videos to upload in terms of to teach you something. You have to understand, the whole point of life is make sure that you're teaching something along the way so that other people can be more resilient. I realized I gave you some nice beautiful techniques on how you can today escape the 9 to 5. I realized work, I realized you must work 15 hours a week. I mean, get yourself out of the, I realized get yourself out of the mortgage and car debt and do not ever borrow money from the bank. I mean, go and write it down, please. I mean, do not borrow money from the bank. I mean, do not get yourself in a mortgage. You have to rent only. So rent, you have to understand. So rent, medication, in terms of never medication, you never rent medication, you rent accommodation only, and you don't get a car loan, and you don't get loans from the bank. You have to understand. You can see now where my money's going for the next 10 months. You can see who I'm hanging around with. I mean, I've got no time for other people. I've got no time to reply to you online. I mean, do not even write to me because I have no time to reply to you. I'm too focused on my business. You get it? I've got no time for women over the next 10 months. I've got no time for kids for the next 10 months. I have to boost my manhood. I have to live alone. I have to live single. You get it? I, although, have 10 months of freedom. I don't have to work a 9 to 5. Or does they have to work a 9 to 5? Or does they have to work a 9 to 5? I don't have to work a 9 to 5. You get it? I mean, how I get my money? I borrow it. I mean, I mean, how is it fair for a millionaire and a billionaire to go grab money from the bank so that they can become more rich? I mean, let me just go and grab money from the government to become more rich. I mean, it's the same, I mean, it's the same scenario. I mean, I go to the bank to grab $1 million to get real estate to become richer, or I go to the government to get some allowance or some money so that I can have more time freedom. I realize it's the same thing. I realize you go and use money, and you use other people's money to succeed. You have to understand that sometimes the best option you can do, you have to understand, which is right now, you have to understand that right now, the best time is now. You have to understand that sometimes is always now. You have to understand that when you have a goal, you must write it down. You must write everything down. I already said that no matter what, that I can go and work the nine to five and make a thousand bucks and I'll have a hundred days worth of freedom. I mean, a hundred days worth of freedom, I mean, it's better than working a hundred days in a nine to five. I may work 30 hours for the thousand bucks, although I never work for the thousand bucks. I'll never work for the thousand bucks. I'll just go make a thousand bucks and then I'll quit the Centrelink and I'll quit them. You get it? I'll quit them totally. I don't need their money. I go make some money. I save some money. I put myself in accommodation over here with my dad, who is my biological dad. I sit down. I count my money. I have 2,000. I have 200 days worth of freedom. And that's that. I become happier because I don't have to work a nine to five. I've got something to do already. I realize that they don't have to ever chase me. I just have to cut them loose. I cut them loose. I already got 10 minutes. I've got 10 months of freedom. I've got the power. I've got the option to have 10 months of freedom. Although, you have to understand that it's really my sacrifice. I've got no sacrifices. I never sacrifice anything other than, you have to understand, I never sacrifice anything. I, I sacrifice the 9 to 5. Although, guess what? I never sacrifice the 9 to 5. I just never choose to go there. I never sacrifice anything. I just move away from the 9 to 5 job. I can make a thousand bucks. I can sit down and for the next 10 months, or else for the next, or else for the next three months, I can live for free. You have to understand that it's really just be smart now. You be smart. So I've taught you already some ideas on how you can become financially free. So get away from the mortgage and get away from the bank loans and get away from the car loans and get away from the car and throw away your car and you'll make 3,000 bucks. Straight away. I mean, for that whole year, you're probably giving 30,000 bucks for that car. I mean, get away from it. I mean, 3,000 bucks will get you two months of rent instead. You get it? And then guess what? 
you can go and travel like I did around Australia and just keep delaying the nine to five and get the money and keep going. Or you sit in one area like I am right now and for the next 10 months, you're going to be free. You're going to live on 10 bucks a day. You're going to forget your crowd. You're going to forget the community you grew up with. You're going to forget the friends around you. You're going to be focused on your business and doing these YouTube videos and boosting your status on Instagram and giving people knowledge to succeed while also just making sure that you find freedom more and go and plan more. Otherwise now, you have to understand that you may have grabbed an idea from this video. I hope you have, because guess what? I've given you many ideas on how I find more freedom in this video. I realize now that I, I, realize I realize that in this video, I do have also one more rule, and it's my one hour rule. I realize for the next 10 years, in terms of the next 10 months of what's going on, I realize I'll be using the one hour rule, which states, 23 hours of the day, I'll just be in this box. I'll just be in this box over here. Well, that's now, I'll have no sex with other women. Well, I'm not a woman. I'll never, I'll never have sex with women for the next 10 months. Well, that's sometimes my communication language is pretty straight on. You have to understand I'm really smart. Although, guess what? I don't need women. I don't need them at all. You have to understand, I've got everything I ever need, making sure that whatever I do is to succeed. You have to understand, it's really... Now, you can see where my money is going and how I'm living my life much better. You understand? So, I've already seen Australia for one year and four months while they were working a nine-to-five job. You get it? Because the same way I've seen Australia for one year and four months, I promise you people are going around the world for 30 years with the real estate money they got from the bank. You get it? I mean, it's the same thing. You're just looking to borrow other people's money to succeed. So go find somebody who's got the money and then go and live for free. Otherwise, that's it. Otherwise, you can go and start real estate today and make a fortune. Although, guess what? You need a 25% down payment. And now it's not a down payment. Otherwise, it's a 25% investment of the property. Otherwise, if the property is 4 million bucks, you need to come up with a million. And then you can go and really do it. Otherwise, now, if the property is 150,000 bucks, you then will calculate 25% of that nice beautiful property there and you have to come up with it. I mean, go and borrow money from people around you. And then you have to put somebody in there and then they're going to give you some money. Although it will say that Grand Cardone says, do not get yourself anything under 16 units. Otherwise now, I point you in the direction of Grand Cardone and he has a beautiful playlist of 187 videos and more in real estate and every single Monday, he goes and tunes into it and he gives you more real estate knowledge about today's economy. I'll see you guys in the next video.